In fact, a follow-up segment tonight when the Obama administration announced Khalid Sheikh Mohammed and four other al-Qaeda thugs would be tried here in New York City in civilian court, I said this. Do you think the 9-11 families want to see a circus? Do you think they appreciate the fact that an al-Qaeda killer and his lawyers will get to spew all kinds of anti-American propaganda because that's what's going to happen? Well, I'm an oracle. Scott Fencermaker, one of the lawyers representing an accused al-Qaeda killer, says the terrorists would explain in court why 9-11 happened and give their assessment of American foreign policy. Oh, I can't wait. With us now is Mr. Fencermaker. Now, if the anti-American stuff dominates the trial, which it has to on your side, the defense, um, don't you think the 9-11 families are going to suffer hearing this kind of garbage? Well, I don't necessarily think that the, their defense is going to be anti-American. I think it's basically going to be a justification defense. Uh, I don't a justification I, for murdering 3,000 civilians? That's a pretty tough nut. Well, I think that the jury decides whether they've murdered 3,000. Well, first of all, I don't think it's 3,000 people. I think it's less than that. But uh, however many it is, uh, I think the jury decides Do you think there's my, any justification on earth to kill thousands of civilians who go to work in the morning? Is there anything to justify that? Uh, I, that's, I'm not the person who's going to be making that decision. You're I the lawyer. The, I, I mean, the you're jury... going to be asked that question. Surely you're going to be prepared to answer it. Well, as, as I explained before, I'm actually not going to be representing my But you're working on the team. That's right. All right, well, I'll ask it again. Is there any justification on this earth to murder thousands of innocent people? Well, as I said, the trial is to determine whether they, they were murdered or not, and they, the jury's going to decide that. Are you, are you sitting here as a human being telling me the people on 9-11 weren't murdered? Uh, I'm telling you that the jury's going to decide that. And no, that I want to know what you think. I'm not going to be a juror in that case. So I'm you're not going to you're not going to say one way or the other where you feel those people were murdered. I'm not going to. I'm not a juror. Uh, the jurors decide whether they were murdered. Don't you think people murdered. watching you and millions are right now, counselor? And I don't mean right. this with any disrespect. Think you're a weasel. They might. That's fine. Because I do, and I, and I I've been, you, you I've been seem called. like a nice guy, but I'm saying this guy sitting in front of me he doesn't think that these people were murdered on 9/11. When we saw what happened, if he won't say they were murdered or not, he's a weasel. You said that uh, I said that they weren't murdered. What I said is that the jurors are. I'm gonna, the ones you want me to ask you a third time? Do you think they were murdered or not? Uh, I'm saying that the jurors decide All that right, in our country. That's a Weasley answer. Okay. All right. Thank now, you. now, in the courtroom, we are going to hear Al Qaeda propaganda. Correct. Uh, I wouldn't say that that's the case. I would say you're going to hear a lot of propaganda, but I wouldn't necessarily say you're well, going to hear... Well, if they're Al-Qaeda, what kind of propaganda? Are we going to hear Roman Catholic propaganda? You're going to hear a lot of United States government propaganda. So you're going to attack... The, the strategy is to attack the United States government foreign policy and the way they operate. Uh, I wouldn't say that. I would say that all I'm saying is that you're going to hear a lot of United States government propaganda. But I don't understand what that means. If you're on the team and you're shaping your defense, what are we going to hear? That the United States is bad? Uh, bad? I don't know what bad means. I you think don't know what bad means. Right. Now we're getting into Bill Clinton territory. We don't okay. know what is means. Okay. You're okay with that? Uh, what I'm okay with is that I think that they're going to put on their defense. The jurors are going to decide whether you, or not... You're, you're part of the defense. I, as I've explained, I'm not going to be part of the I, defense at the trial. I'm, okay, I'm, I don't care about that. You're shaping... I, the, you just got back from Guantanamo Bay. You yes. know these guys. I know are one we gonna, of them. I know we, one of all right, them. you know one of them. Yes. Are we going to hear that they're justified in killing 3,000 American civilians because the country, the USA, is a vile country. Are we going to hear that? Uh, I think that the number of people was actually less than 3,000. All right, that's the third time you said that. Right. Does it really matter whether it was 2,800 or 3,000? Uh, Why do you keep it, harping it, on that point? It does to the 200 people who are the difference. Uh -huh. That's a wise guy comment about three people who were murdered. I'm telling you, you're really in deep trouble here, Counselor. Oh, All right, let you. me ask you okay. another question. Why would you, a graduate of the Air Force Academy, right. why would you want to go and put yourself in this position? It's because I'm a graduate of the Air Force Academy. The way these men have been treated is contrary to the values of the United States, and I'm here to protect the uh, protections that they have. And if, if you're... All right, and I don't mind that. I mean, yes. everybody deserves a defense. I think yes. it should be military tribunals, and the JAG should do it, but that's, okay. that's a difference, and I don't mind that. Do you hope that they are acquitted? Uh, I hope that they get a fair trial, and I hope that whoever their lawyer is helps them get that fair trial. Okay, but you're using your skill and intelligence to try to get them acquitted, are you not? Uh, I'm not going to be part of the trial, as I've said uh, several times, but um, we will certainly try and get them a fair trial. Okay, but you're using your skill to try to convince a jury that they're not guilty. Why else would you be a defense attorney? Uh, I think That's your oath. You have to do that. I think that that's part of uh, getting them a fair trial, yes. Yeah, okay. So you don't have any compunction about that? I'm proud to do it. I'm honored you're proud to do it. To do it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So if, if you're successful, if you and your team are successful and they walk free, 
Your well, they, they won't. They won't walk free. Our government will never let them go. Okay, but 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 say they did. Say okay. say the judge threw it out because they weren't Mirandized when they were captured in Pakistan. Okay, you'd be happy. You go out and celebrate and have dinner. Uh, well, I don't know what I'm going to do after the but trial. But you'd be happy. Uh, I I would be glad that I played a role in attending in, in having them freed. If that's a just result, certainly, right. absolutely, I'd be honored. Last question. Yes. You know people hate you, right? Do you care? Uh, actually, I don't know that people hate me. No, but trust me. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll forward you the emails. Okay. Do you care? <laughs> uh, no. No, I'm, I'm honored that they hate me. I'm honored that they hate me. Really? Yes. That's I'm an honored. interesting point of view. Yes. And you're honored why? I'm honored because the people who hate me uh, hate uh, the rule of law. Counsel, we appreciate you having sure. the uh, courage to come on in. Sure, no problem. All right. Pleasure meeting you. Plenty more ahead as the factor moves along this evening. Some very powerful American religious people say they're fed up and are even encouraging law-breaking and cultural.